Hi everyone, I hope you had a great weekend. Well, we made it. Welcome to the final week of remote learning. That sounds so crazy to say out loud and I can't believe that we're here. I want to start this video with a heartfelt and sincere thank you to both students and parents and families. Your hard work, both in learning and completing assignments, as well as supporting that process, figuring out tech glitches, communicating with me incessantly, none of that support and hard work goes unnoticed. So please accept this heartfelt gratitude from me to you. Now, let's get going and kick this week's butt. The last week of learning means that there's a lot of dates to remember, so let's go over this week. Monday, June 15th at 3 p.m. There will be a support call for submitting your videos or your PowerPoint slides digitally to me, and this call will be recorded for students who can't make it. Tuesday, June 16th at 3 p.m. Your core competency self-assessment that was assigned a couple weeks ago is now due. This is your part of your final report card, so make sure that you get it done. Genius Hour presentations will be on Wednesday, June 17th at 10 and 1 p.m., Thursday, June 18th at 10 and 1 p.m., and Friday, June 19th at 10 a.m. On Friday night, we celebrate. You have your grade seven farewell virtual watch party. This party starts at 7 p.m. and a link will be sent through Teams in our general channel for everyone to join. You can join the call at 6.45 with your microphones muted, and you can dress up if you like but you don't have to. As you finish building your presentation this week, keep coming back to the assignment criteria that we shared in OneNote to make sure that you've covered all the things that you need to. Then practice, practice, practice. Take note of the date and time that you signed up to share your final presentation. An emailed list was sent to your parents and a final copy was posted in both teams and in Monday's daily list of awesomeness, so check it out. Please set aside two hours during the time slot you signed up for and plan to remain in the call for the entirety of the session. So we're looking for your camera to be on throughout the entire presentation time, good audience skills, students acting professionally, and engaging in other students' presentations by asking questions at the end. Like we've said all year, let's show the respect for others that we expect that they give to us. Remember that the slides or your video file need to be to me 24 hours in advance of your presentation. Families have been emailed with their child's presentation slot and when the digital files are due by. Students can send files directly to me in Teams chat or upload to OneDrive and share the link with me via email. If you don't know how to do this, once again, we have a support call for this on Monday at 3 p.m., but I will post the recorded video if you can't make it. Remote learning officially ends this Friday, June 19th. If you're already attending school in person, the last week of June 22nd continues to be optional, but know that we are not doing work at school in the traditional sense in that last week. The classes as they are right now will also only run on Monday and Tuesday of that last week. So there will be no regular Wednesday to Friday session for anyone except for the children of essential service workers. So the rules change a bit for that last week of June 22nd. If you attend on Mondays or Tuesdays earlier throughout this month, you'll come only on Monday, June 22nd. So that means if you're attending usually on a Tuesday, you'd come on Monday in that last week instead. Monday kids would stay the same. If you attended on Fridays, you're now going to come on Tuesday, June 23rd instead. Your supervising teacher for that chunk of time will remain the same. So with this in mind, please let us know as soon as you can if your attendance plan for that last week changes. That's all for this week. Please know that I will make one more video for you next week, and I'll share an opportunity to come by to the school and say goodbye to me. I would love to see so many of you that I haven't gotten a chance to see, so details on that are to come next week. Have a great last week of remote learning, and thank you again for all of your hard work. Good luck with the presentations, Div, too. I'll see you soon.